Hey guys, so I wanted to do a haul video for you and I don't know, I feel like I haven't been shopping a lot lately which is good, like I really like that because I save money, you know? And um, I just went crazy this time because I got my first paycheck of my new job which is no big deal, it's just part-time job but um, I'm really excited to share with you and I got Forever 21, Sephora stuff and I that's where I got my sister's present as well because my older sister turned 22 November 9th and we're going out next week so the 24th which is like so delayed but anyways yeah I'm gonna get started I guess I want to start with Forever 21 first because I got the Forever 21 stuff like days ago and I've been really wanting to do a haul video but I just wanted to like make it a bigger haul video and put them all together in one so yeah let's get started so first I wanted to show you this top that I'm wearing right now this one I'm so in love with this I'm so glad that I got this I don't remember the price I think it was $23.80 because yeah it's $23.80 and it's just you know a plain white what do you call this material like chiffon material is that what you call it like it feels very it's very sheer as you can see but it's not cotton at all and um it's great for any season i believe like this would be great for winter summer and any season i mean you can, it's just up to you how you dress it up but i'm really really in love with this and especially this uh part right here i like this so much it just has these like silver studs and I'm wearing a gold necklace because I just threw them on threw this on um just a couple of minutes ago so I can show you how it looks and um yeah so it's pretty long like it's just like uh you know your standard long sleeve but just like a really nice chiffon material with the studs and then the other ones I got two more I got this this um skirt which is very very shimmery um it's 11.50 and i got a large one i'm becoming large you guys <laughs> and this is great that i'm getting a large one because usually when i get medium and they go into dryer after they become small and they never fit me anymore like i'm never small i used to be small when i was like 13 years old but now that i'm 20 i'm bigger I've grown <laughs> so yeah I got a large one I've learned my lesson and yeah I mean I can avoid putting them in the dryer but it's just so much work to like hang them and wait for them to dry and stuff like that anyway so yeah it's like shimmery kind of um, really light blue material and um, I'm planning to wear this next week um, for my sister's birthday celebration and I'm really excited and I'm planning to actually wear it with this one so you're gonna see this again if you if you follow my website I will be posting a outfit of the day or outfit of the night there for next week so you guys will see what I'm gonna wear for next week if you're interested I will link it down below I just I just plan to wear this along with this top right here or if not I'm gonna wear it with this top right here which is another chiffon material, but this one's a lot more expensive, I guess, because it has a lot more, like, sophisticated stud, whatever these are called. Um, this was $29.80. This is my favorite part. I mean, I could have DIY this because, what do you call this, like, Fashion Say 04 did a DIY on this, I think she did, or I'm pretty sure Beauty Crush did as well, so I don't know, I just... I just thought I could buy this now because I really have been picking out an outfit for next week. So, um, but it's one of those like kind of like high low kind of top. I don't know if that's what you really call it, but it's like shorter in the front and like so much more longer in the back. You can't really tell because it's all like wrinkly, but I was planning to kind of, you know, bring this back to Forever 21 because it has a mark on it. Look at that. I don't know if you can really see if it's focusing or not. But I should have probably brought it today. I went to Fairview Mall today and I should have brought this and exchanged it. So that's my Forever 21 stuff. Now, okay, so I guess I should start with Sephora. Sephora! So I just learned recently that you can only become a VIP if you spend $375 per year. 
which is crazy because I cannot spend that much on makeup. Especially Sephora is so expensive. I mean, probably if I have this routine makeup that I like keep buying whenever I run out, but I don't. Like I never run out of things except for foundation. I always run out of foundation. Well, actually not always, but if I were to choose a specific product that I always run out of, it would be foundation. And my favorite foundation is by MAC, so I can't buy it from Sephora, so I can never be a VIB at all. <laughs> Hopefully next year, I don't know. You never know, right? So I'm gonna show you what I got. First, this is the most exciting thing. I already gave this to my sister, but I told her, put it back in the box <laughs> because I'm gonna do a haul video. And she was okay with it. She liked it, actually, especially the bag. She really liked it. And um, this was what I gave her for her birthday. It's a Too Faced Love Sweet Love um, gift set. And this one is great, you guys. If you, like, are struggling to find a you know, holiday gift for someone special or something, I would recommend Sephora stuff because they have amazing um, gift sets, especially Benefit. They have like this 38 bucks worth of gift set full of makeup, especially if you're giving it to someone who loves makeup. I don't know, she's always losing her makeup for some reason, so I always have to buy her over and over again, especially on her birthdays. <laughs> So um, I decided to buy her this because it has all the things that she always would use. She likes to use primer. One of her favorite one is the Make It Forever one. Dun -dun -dun -dun! I'm so excited. Look at this. So pretty. It has this um, Juicy Couture kind of material. It's going to get dirty right away, especially with her. <laughs> My sister can be kind of clumsy sometimes, like me. All right, so let's open it. So it comes in this, like it's like packaged in this pink paper thing and it has all this great stuff. So it comes with a sample size Too Faced Shadow Insurance. She loves this stuff. I don't think she has this right now but she always uses mine because her eyelids get kind of oily sometimes so she needs this. She likes this and it's good that it comes in this set right here and I have the full full size one um, which I never run out of <laughs> right here because I also have the um, the Urban Decay one so that's that and then she also has the, the sample size of the Prime and Poreless this one is amazing you guys you can even use this alone you don't even need to use a foundation before this or after this if you have, especially if you have perfect skin so this was just do a great job with mattifying your face. And then it comes with a brush. What a really cute brush. Look at this pink brush. Look at that. It's so nice. Love it. And it also comes with an eyeliner. Another sample size. Right here. And the only full size, I believe, is the mascara. Which is the Too Faced Lash Gasm Mascara. But I haven't really used this one before, so I don't know how it works. But it'll be good for her. She likes anything. Oh, this one this one looks like it would work pretty well. And yeah, and this one sucks because the eyeliner was like cut off. It was like falling down. So we kind of have to sharpen it for her. This eyeliner definitely sucks. I don't know what, what it is, but it sucks. <laughs> You can't really sharpen it well without it looking funny. Anyway, so it's really dark. I mean, I guess that's what matters <laughs> right now. And then I got, um, it comes with this Too Faced palette, We come, which comes with six eyeshadows, two blushes, two lip glosses. And it has all, it has a mirror, first of all, and it has this um, little quote thing, when I saw you I fell in love and you smiled because you knew by William Shakespeare. I love William Shakespeare. And it has all these like tutorial and how you use it. And I'm definitely going to do her makeup once with all these looks. And then this is what it comes with. So it comes with all these eyeshadows. Vanilla Sugar Iced Mocha Eyes. I don't really want to swatch it because it's hers. So yeah. And then it has like two blushes. I guess this would be, I don't know. It's a really light blush. And then two lip glosses. So yeah, that's that. It's, it's 
pretty, pretty amazing. And it's 50, it was 58 bucks worth of 100, I think 120 something worth of products. So the next two are, as I said, I got a separate Too Faced Primed and Poreless because lately I've just been using foundation alone without primer and I feel like that's the reason why my foundation doesn't stay long. Yeah, I got the Too Faced Primed and Poreless and this one would have to be my favorite primer ever. It's but it's just so expensive. It's 38 bucks for this freaking primer. Like, what is wrong with you, Too Faced? I guess it's good because it's it, it's great to be used alone. It's like it acts kind of like a BB cream, but it has the neutral tone in it. It doesn't have like a specific shade for you. And um, at the same time, you can use it underneath a foundation and stuff like that. So, and it's great product. I mean. It's just too expensive. I mean, probably would never buy this again. I don't know what came to me why I bought this, but I'm definitely gonna love it. I just hate buying expensive products when you can buy something else. That's why I don't always shop at Sephora. Anyways, the next one is my birthday gift from Sephora, and I um, it was my birthday August 12th. I never got to get my own gift from them because that's how long I haven't shopped in Sephora. Like even longer than that so yeah I got this sugar kiss fret by fresh uh, mini lip duo and they're like lip treatments so these are good I guess hopefully let's see oh my back hurts it has two it comes with two things and the first one sugar rose with SPF 15 it's tinted lip treatment and then the, the other one is just a sugar lip treatment. So I guess the other one is tinted, the other one is not, right? Maybe? So yeah, the other one is just clear. Which I probably use more often. And then the other one is tinted. Which looks like that, so I don't know. It's not that tinted, I mean it's just a hint of color right there. Last things that I got are candles from Bath and Body Works. My sisters, my little sis my little twin sisters and I were like looking around Bath and Body Works and we couldn't decide which scent that we wanna we wanna get we wanna get because they were having this five for twenty five uh for those little candles the smaller version of the bigger ones and um like the bigger ones they sell for two for thirty bucks but I learned from its duty time that it's not really worth buying those bigger ones because especially if you get tired of scents easily and you want you just want to keep changing up the scents the candles that you you currently use I think that would be a good idea if you buy smaller ones like never buy bigger ones if you get sick of scents right away so I learned my lesson and got me some smaller ones Alright, and um, I even got the, the smaller, smaller ones, like the smallest one they have. And those are 2 for 5, which I thought, you know what, 5 for 25, you only get 5 candles and you pay 25 bucks. But if you get 2 for 5, you get, you pay 20 bucks, you get 8 candles. So you can try out 8 different cents for 20 bucks as opposed to 5 cents for 25 bucks. Um, it's one of their holiday traditions, obviously. And it's a winter candy apple. It smells just like... Actually, I don't know why I got this. Because I hate the smell of air fresheners. Or, you know those things that you put in the car? Like, they hang in your car and they smell like this... I don't know. This type of freshener. And I just hate those. And it smells just like this. And I'm probably just going to give it to my sister. Because they, they don't really mind. I have really... I'm really sensitive when it comes to scents. I, I got this node in... I don't know how this smells like. It's pretty good. It's very wintry. That's what I can say. And these two are what by White Barnes. So this one is in Nutmeg and Spice. This one smells so good. Oh, love it. This one is by Bath and Body Works and it's Peppermint Mocha and this is what my one of my sisters chose and they're gonna have this in their room and it smells just like chocolate and peppermint. <laughs> one is by Slatkin & Co if I'm saying that right and it's called Sparkling Icicles and this one smells like Abercrombie, Abercr Abercrombie and Fitch and it smells just like the other one that I have already. It's the Paris one that I already own so it's not nothing new to me. And then there's 
It's Mary Mistletoe. My sisters chose this. And it smells good. I'm not good with describing scents, you guys. So I'm just going to tell you which smells good. The Toffee Crunch, which I'm so excited about. Toffee Crunch. It smells just like caramel, toffee, and yeah, goodness. Called Mahogany Teakwood. And I have a feeling it smells like apricot and finch as well. Those are all for this haul, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And um, if you're interested to see pictures of these or any reviews of these, I will post them in my website, which is makeupbymissy.com. Once I use them, I will do a review on them and um, make sure you keep updated to my website. So until next time, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Hold on, let me just check if this is actually filming. Sometimes there's just, you know, problems when you're actually talking and talking and it's just not filming. And, oh, my back hurts. Oh my gosh. This really sucks. Primed and porch por porchless. Yay, it didn't sharpen well. Right. Oops, I'm so clumsy. You pay 20 bucks, you get, do the math. Two, four, six, eight.